everybody, welcome to another edition of Ed's Attention to Detail. Today, I've got something that I haven't done in a little while. Got a mail call. Yeah. So, got a couple of shop cards that were sent this week. And I also want to talk about what's going to be coming up on the workbench. Now, I know that some of you that have been watching, you know that we're building a house and that I haven't done anything as far as a workbench. Um, I managed to get a table, I managed to get a small spot, and I'm going to be doing a little bit of work when I find the free time. Now that's going to be the key, is finding free time uh, in between building a house and everything else that's going on right now. But that's what I'm going to be working on. It's a A4F Skyhawk, it is by Monogram, it's a Pro Modeler series. And I picked this thing up, it was already open, it was used, but I picked it up when I was down at Robbins Air Force Base last year and they had this for $20 but it had a note on it and the note right here says that this supports the B-17 restoration that they were doing down at Robbins Air Force Base down at the museum so somebody donated this kit to the museum and uh, used it for raising money for the B-17 restoration. So, anyway, this is what I'm gonna be working on periodically, and I'll make sure that you guys get to see uh, progress as I go on it. Now, the reason why I have these other kits sitting out here, you probably ask. If you're only gonna work on one, why do you got some other kits sitting out there? I'm gonna address that in a minute. But before I do that, let's take a look at these shop cars. So the first one came from, Russell's Model Cars. So, thank you, Russell Model Cars. Um, I really appreciate the shop card. Nice little note on the back. Uh, very personable, great looking shop card, by the way. And uh, I saw that a few other folks, uh, a few other you guys had gotten these shop cards. And uh, I commented that I liked the shop card and he actually offered to send me one so thank you so much to Russell for doing that RMC uh, Russell's model cars now the other one this is from I can get it out of, the, out of the envelope here FMC Frizzo's model cars so I got a shop card, got a nice little note written on the back of that, personal note. Thank you so much for that, I really appreciate it. Got this cool little decal, so I'm gonna have to find a place to put that. And then a second shop card, also Frizzo's model cars. And uh, this this is more more the, the YouTube uh, kind of shop card, and uh, this this is awesome. And it's got a couple of his models there, one of them up on a lift. So, anyway, thank you for sending me the mail. Now, I am making shop card. Well, okay, not making them. I have my shop card ready to go to the printer. But, because of everything else that we've been doing, I just ain't uh, really found the time and made it a priority to get them sent off to the printer. But, I'll show you what they're going to look like. Check it out. Now, if you guys uh, don't mind, leave me a comment. Tell me what you think of, of my idea for a shop card. You can tell me that, you know, hey, when you get those printed, I'd like to have one. You can go ahead and put that in there as well, and I'll make a list and keep track, and uh, I'll be in touch and get addresses and stuff. So hopefully I can get shop cards somewhere within the next, I don't know, 10 or 15 years. Uh, no, just kidding. Um, but, but hopefully sometime in the near future I can get them printed and actually get them sent out. So, all right. Back to the models. Remember I was talking about the Skyhawk. The Blue Angels are transitioning this year to the F-18 Super Hornet. The F-A-18E single seat and the F-A-18F, which is a twin seat. They are transitioning for the 2021 show season. That's when they're supposed to start flying the Super Hornet. 
Now I got to thinking about that and I saw the pictures of the first F-18E that was delivered to the Blue Angels. And I got to thinking that, wow, it'd be really cool to build a Blue Angel Super Hornet. So I've already got a Super Hornet kit, F-18E, single seat. So I went online and I was looking around. So far I have not found anybody that does decals for the Super Hornet for Blue Angels, but I'm sure that it's coming soon. So that's my plan for that one. And of course, you know, this one already is going to be a Blue Angels A4. Now this Cougar, I got to looking at it and I was actually quite surprised. And being a Navy guy, I should have known this already. The Blue Angels flew the Cougar. And the decal sheet that comes with this model actually has Blue Angels decals in it. Here and here. So this is what really spurred me on to thinking about building a Blue Angels historical fleet. Now, you guys probably also know, and I'm going to leave a little something up here in the corner, a little info tag for you, um, but I've already got uh, the current Blue Angels aircraft. I've already got that one. I've got it built. So I'm going to start adding to that and I'm going to build the Blue Angels fleet and I'm going to try and do it all in 148 scale. <clears throat> now this might take me a while to do it, but that's my plan. That's where I'm going with it. That's what's happening on my workbench now that I got one again. And uh, hopefully sometime in the near future, you guys are going to see a little bit of progress on that A4. So until then, I appreciate you guys watching. Take care, God bless, and remember, pay attention to the details. We'll see you again soon. Bye. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and go ahead and hit the notification button so you know when I'm doing a new video. Like this video, and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Also, feel free to share this with any of your social media sites.